In this video, we'll learn how to migrate virtual machines and containers between nodes in a cluster in Proxmox virtual environment. Migration allows us to easily move any virtual machine or container to another Proxmox node. This can be helpful when retiring an old node from service or moving machines over in preparation for maintenance on a server. It's possible to do offline or live migrations. Let's see how to perform both. Offline migrations are when the VM or CT experiences downtime during the entire migration process. These migrations are extremely simple to do. For this demonstration, I'll perform an offline migration for the 100 Ubuntu VM currently on Server 1. In the Proxmox interface, in the Resource tree, under Data Center, Server 1, I'll click on 100 Ubuntu VM. Note the VM is currently not running. I'll right-click on 100 Ubuntu VM and select Migrate. In the Migrate window, note the mode defaults to offline. Then, we need to select the node where we want to migrate this VM. In my case, I'll click on the Target Node drop-down menu arrow and select Server 2. Finally, I'll click Migrate to begin the migration process. This process should take just a few seconds. The Task Viewer window will inform about the progress, and when the machine has been migrated, it will display Task OK in the output. We can confirm the migration was successful by expanding the Server 2 object and observing that 100 Ubuntu VM is now present on Server 2. Let's perform an online migration. Live or online migration in Proxmox is the process of moving a running virtual machine or container from one node to another within the same cluster without any downtime or disruption to the services running on the VM or CT. This feature is particularly useful in environments where high availability and minimal service interruptions are critical. For this demonstration, I'll perform an online migration for the 102 Ubuntu VM currently running on Server 1. In the Proxmox interface, in the Resource tree, under Data Center, Server 1, I'll click on 102 Ubuntu VM. Note the VM is currently running. I'll right-click on 102 Ubuntu VM and select Migrate. In the Migrate window, note the mode defaults to Online. Then, we need to select the node where we want to migrate this VM. In my case, I'll click on the Target Node drop-down menu arrow and select Server 3. Finally, I'll click Migrate to begin the migration process. This process will take longer than an offline migration because it involves synchronizing the memory and state of a running virtual machine or container in real-time, while ensuring minimal disruption to the workload. The Task Viewer window will inform about the progress, and when the machine has been migrated, it will display Task OK in the output. We can verify the migration was successful by expanding the Server 3 object. We can notice that 102 Ubuntu VM now exists on Server 2. You are now ready to perform your offline or live migrations in Proxmox virtual environment. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.